The challenges being faced in, in Alberta right now are, are significant. When you look at the reduction in the price of oil and you look at the reduction in investments, uh, we know that the, uh, the rate of unemployment is, is getting worse here. And um, I think it would be fair to say the challenges are, are not by any stretch of the imagination over. So, uh, so I completely get it. And, and I think it's something that we need to, to think about hard as we not only think about our budget, but we, we more broadly think about uh, how we can be, be helpful in that uh, significant transition that's going on. The equalization program is a program that's um, it's got a formula. It's got a formula on how we, how we use that, uh, how we equalize across provinces. And um, it's one that's been agreed to in advance. And it's one that uses a, a three-year average of, of how uh, each provincial economy is working. Uh, and uh, there's an outcome that comes out of that. Um, so I, I think if we start fiddling around with that formula, it'll have um, it'll be quite challenging for us in terms of those negotiations. Uh, it would be something we'd want to do uh, with a great deal of, of uh, caution because we want to make sure that any outcome would be something we're comfortable with. It's not something we're talking about right now. So I talked about uh, tax cuts for the middle class. Uh, those will provide stimulative impacts across the country, but they'll help people here in Alberta as well. Uh, the Canada Child Benefit, which we're looking to increase significantly for Canadians up to $150,000 of income, will also have a stimulative effect on the economy. But specifically around infrastructure investments, we're going to think about how those can, can, be, can be put into different parts of the country. And certainly we'll be thinking about Alberta as a place where, because of the uh, likely increase in unemployment, there's an opportunity to um, for really great workers to be involved in what could be those sorts of projects.